guys, I'm Sebastian here, going to be doing you a tutorial video today showing you the full length basics and techniques on how to set up, record and play with your capture device, the easy cap, ease cap, whatever you want to call it and you will be able to capture gameplay from the PS3, Xbox 360 and the Nintendo Wii if you use that. So enough with the chit chat, let's see what you have to buy or you need for this tutorial now this part of the video will be giving you people that haven't bought anything yet for recording and want uh, to know what stuff you will need for your easy cap so i prepared a little shopping list if you have already bought the items or are ready for the actual tutorial you can skip this part of the video or carry on if you think you have missed out a part let's start the shopping list all these uh, items are basically from Amazon.co.uk or .com you can get them from either. This is where I got all of my stuff from and all the links to them will be in the description. Some you won't need because some come with it or some you might have if you bought them previously. The first thing you'll need is your easy cap, the ease cap, easy cap, or whatever. This is the capture device you'll be using to actually record the game. This is what records the actual image that you see YouTubers have. The second thing you'll need is a double AV, double ended AV composite cable. This is the thing that connects all the cables and components up together to arrange it so it can record. The next thing you'll need is three splitters. Three splitters to split up them so that you can connect and it goes its own separate ways to connect to its certain part. The, fur, uh, the fourth thing you'll need is a PS3, Xbox or we AV composite cables. This normally comes with the console so you don't have to worry but if you don't have one I would just search one up at your local game dealer shop whatever um, however that works. And the fifth one which is optional which actually does actually come with the easy cap is the recording software. I've lost my easy cap disc unfortunately but uh, I use and um, you can use recording programs like Power Director 9 and that all, the, all these like major video editing software should come with a record feature uh, the one I have records it perfectly and I don't didn't need really that disc anyway but it's a shame that I've lost it so that is a uh, optional thing if you want to use a disc use a disc but I won't be able to show you a tutorial because I do not have the disc so let's begin the first step of assembling your um, your easy cap to your console also i'm going to be showing a preview video of all the stuff on the floor uh, before i start the actual uh, setup so let's begin this is all of the equipment that you should already have take another minute to check if you have the right equipment if you don't try and find it and um, just basically get it because without this equipment you can't start the tutorial so let's begin okay now take your easy cap uh, stretch out the cables and take a double-ended AV cable plug the white into white which mine are black because I just got ones that are black uh, the red into red and the yellow into yellow once you've done that, it should look something like this. This is the easy cap connected to the double AV composite cable. Once you've grabbed the other end, we take our free splitters and plug them into the single uh, head uh, or like single female outlet uh, that's indicated. Once it's all plugged in, it should look something like that. And free plugged into the female splitters. Now either take your uh, PS3 AV uh, uh, composite cable or the double ended ones and plug the red with the red one coming out the other side of the female splitter, the white coming out with the other white female splitter and the yellow into the yellow. Same with the double ended cable after, this is how it should look like after the, um, when, you plug into, when you plug your games console cable in. Now to finally take the uh, composite cable, double, uh, the second double composite cable, a blended composite cable, and plug it into the same coloured uh, ports next to the other ones, yellow into yellow, white into white, and finally red into red. It should look something like this when you're finished.
to start connecting it up together so it's linked to your TV and PC, we take the easy cap itself, take off the lid and we insert it into a USB drive in our PC or laptop. Our next step is taking our console composite cable or AV cable whatever you say and plug it into the back of your console either your PS3, Xbox 360 or Wii. Next we take one of our double ended AV cables or composite cables and plug them into the back of your TV. This is how it should look like when plugged in. Now moving away from our cables we go onto our PS3 and from the HDMI or comp component cables we go on display settings, select video options and scroll down to composite engine. Now that it's been changed to S video or composite video you select 19 by 9 to make it widescreen or else it will be a small 4x3. Set your audio options to audio input connector slash scart slash AV multi. Now you're completely finished and you are ready to record. Now open up your recording software, uh, either the EasyCat program that came with it, unfortunately I do not have it because I've lost a disc, but it's pretty easy to set up and the settings, you can find a video on YouTube to set it up. And basically all you do is you hit record, then you can add commentary uh, alongside it in another program like Audacity or with this with PowerDirector you can record your audio and your mic which is pretty good. So that is basically how you record it and now let's have a look at the finished product. Well guys this is the end product of the Easy Cap. Uh, I don't really know what settings it can go up to, something like 460p or something like that. But I put it up on 720p when I upload my videos on my gaming channel. I'll put an annotation around the screen so you can go and check it out. But I use a HD PVR now. If you want me to do a tutorial like this for the HD PVR, PVR comment down and I might. And this is the first time in a video I'm asking you, could you please like and favourite this video if you enjoyed it, if you liked it, if you thought it was good because it did take a lot of time and dedication to make. But I'm a person that loves making videos so I would do anything for you guys. Anyway guys, thank you for watching this. I hope it's helped you. If you want to leave a video response of down what you've created with your easy cap once you've watched this, please feel free. I will approve them. And yeah, I... Uh, that's really all I have to say. If you have any questions about this tutorial, comment down below. If you haven't subscribed, please be sure to do because it really does help my channel and it means I have more people to make video for. Videos for, sorry about that. But anyway, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.